An interesting development to a story you might remember. The pit bull in Ogden accused of biting a jogger last summer has been crowned the rock top dog. This is a new contest through the Verona Street Animal Society created to raise money for Rochester Animal Services during the pandemic. The winning dog has been in confinement since the incident in July. Kayla Green reports. Jeremy Wolf is anxiously awaiting a decision regarding the appeal he filed back in the fall to decide whether his dog Vanessa will be released to him or euthanized. Wolf says this weekend was a welcome break from the stress he's been dealing with after the incident with Vanessa last summer. She has a you know, ton of supporters out there and um, you know that those almost 15,000 votes was enough to get her to lead. Uh, so uh, this past weekend, she was, you know, she was crowned as the as the rock top dog. Vanessa is accused of biting a jogging neighbor last July while being walked with another dog by Wolf's girlfriend. Court documents say the bite required 18 stitches, and the jogger is quoted saying she feared for her life. Wolf says there are two sides to the story. Well, Vanessa found herself in a situation where she's been accused now of a bite. So. Um, no, it's just diligence, owner diligence. We think that the evidence is overwhelming on our side. According to the appeal, Wolf's lawyer says the original decision was based off circumstantial evidence and that the jogger has no direct evidence as to which dog bit her. Wolf says his main concern now is Vanessa's well-being. Why is she confined during this time? Why can't we get her out to a sanctuary or someplace where um, she's, she's not being confined to a cage 24-7? For months on end. He says while he considers himself a diligent owner, he's putting even more safety precautions in place. We put up this large enclosure. Uh, this will allow, uh, you know, 3,000 square feet of space for, uh, you know, her to, to run free in a, in a safe, enclosed environment. Uh, you know, we plan to put a fence around it. Well, we are taking steps to prove, you know, not only saying that we're doing, going to do things, but actually doing the things. He says he's not sure when the judge will be making a decision, but he's hoping they'll rule in his favor. In Ogden, Kayla Green, News 8. All right, Kayla, thank you. Three Heads Brewing put Vanessa's face on a new brew for the winning contest, or for winning the contest, we should say.